up, we have the most obvious one, Patrick Kane. He's the only player this season to reach 100 points, and he is an absolute lock for the team of the year. Next up, we have last year's Art Ross winner, Jamie Benn. Benn has 88 points in 80 games this season, including over 40 goals. Crosby got off to an uncharacteristically slow start this season, but has really picked it up as of late, helping the Penguins slip into a playoff spot. On to the second line now, the next forward from the San Jose Sharks, we have Joe Pavelski. Our next forward is another player from the Sharks, Joe Thornton. Not only does Burns have the best beard in the NHL, he also has 74 points, including 27 goals, which leads all defensemen. Sagan finished the season averaging more than a point per game with 73 points in 72 games, obviously missing some time because of injuries. We originally didn't have Panarin in our predictions, but he went absolutely insane recently with 8 points in 2 games and just managed to squeak his way in there. The fact that EA didn't give him a player of the game card this past Monday suggests that he will indeed be on the team of the year. Next up we have someone that technically shouldn't make it if you go solely based on points, but 100% will make it because a, he's one of the biggest name players in the NHL, and B, he leads the NHL in goal scoring. If you haven't already guessed, it's Alexander Ovechkin. Our final spot for NHL forwards goes to Vladimir Tarasenko. Tarasenko has continued to dominate the NHL, putting up 71 points in 78 games this season. Let's move on to the defense now, and the first one should be extremely obvious. You can't have an offensive team of the year without Eric Carlson. Carlson is averaging a point per game this season, 79 points in 79 games, which is incredibly impressive considering he's a defenseman. Despite battling through some injuries, Chris Letang has had a fantastic year, putting up 64 points in 69 games. And the final NHL defenseman, Roman Yossi. After a great season last year, Yossi has continued to prove himself as an elite hockey player. He had 58 points in 79 games this season. The NHL goalie shouldn't come as a surprise to anyone. It's Capitals goalie, Braden Holtby. Holtby is a ridiculous 47, 9, and 5 on the season, with a 217 goals against average and a 923 save percentage. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment down below what you think of the predictions, subscribe to all three of us that have YouTube channels, and follow all four of us on Twitter, and uh, I'll see you guys next time.